Next question comes from Tiny Rick on YouTube. What's up, Tiny Rick? Why phosphoric acid over lactic and or acidulated malt? I know you can, but I'd rather use something else to acidify. Okay, so Tiny Rick, which is another great, an, another great YouTube handle. There's a period of time where I was using phosphoric acid to adjust uh, my pH in, in the beers I was brewing at Cartridge. Part of that is phosphoric acid is a very flavor neutral way to adjust that. I know people prefer, a lot of people prefer the slight nuance that you can get with lactic acid instead. But I will also say I was using a buttload of acid in those beers because my pH was so wild, my alkalinity was so high, um, it would just eat the acid and say, we're not even going to drop the pH. So I had to use so much. Um, I felt like phosphoric was a better was a, a better option. I've used lactic in, in, in other situations as well, and I think it's absolutely great. If you are in a situation where you have to use a lot, so I was doing 15 barrel batches, and I mean, it was not uncommon for me to have to throw six, 700 mils of acid just in the mash, and that was at one one and a half quarts per uh, per barrel uh, per pound of grain. So yeah, and then I would need to use more uh, for for the pH for for the sparge, right? So in some cases, you know, I was using you know over maybe a liter or more, and so I, I didn't want to do that, and so I uh, I didn't want to use more than that uh, or that much with with lactic. So I use phosphoric because it tends to be a little bit more flavor neutral. But you absolutely can use uh, lactic and acidulated malt depending on what scale you're at, if you're doing it on the pro side and, and like the, the old school tradition purity of it and you want to run acidulated malt, that's great. If you're in a situation where you do have to acidify your sparge water though, you know, lactic acid would, would obviously be a better fit there. I am personally partial to just using acid rather than acidulated malt. It's cheaper, it's smaller to store, and it's easy. Tiny Rick, thanks for the question. I think that's the first time I, I've heard from you. Uh, welcome to the channel.